Though the interstice stands as the realm between realms, seemingly alone in the endless void and separated from the contact with the other planes of existence, it is constantly affected by the events from the mortal realms. With the machinations of Bellacor and Lord Croak, the mass destruction of the realm gates of Chaman caused a massive bloom of landmass within the interstice. The Tumorous Isle seemingly appeared overnight, north of the Strangleweed Sea. A strange mix of both the realm of death and the realm of life has created a strange island where things appear to both live and die and exist in both life and undeath. The new seed has expanded further with more and more lands being dragged up from the seas. Despite their close proximity with the Grand Lush, the saline soil from the newly pulled up lands proved too inhospitable to plant life to take hold. However, along the fringes, some more bizarre strains of plants are beginning to take root there, and through their adaptation to the lands, have created strange and dangerous flora and fauna. From where the rusted coast was previously, much of the newly gathered landmass comes from Shaman, creating a massive mountain range as well as craggy fjords. The Serratia coast has unassumingly sharp and jagged peaks, which have ruined more exploration vessels that can be counted, the contents of which are likely strewn at the bottom of the inaccessible seas. The strangest of places is the Twisting Polychromatia, an amalgamation of all the realms where the lands seemingly shift continuously and the weather systems are unpredictably chaotic. Attempts at colonizing the area have been met with swift rebuttal from the lands itself, as the unaccommodating nature of the realmscape proves too difficult to manage even for hardy explorers. It is rumored that something of great significance is drawing forces in, but no one is able to say for sure. At the same time as the realm seemingly broke apart by the plans of Bellacor and Lord Croak, the Carcosan Gateway, long whispered to be dormant realm gate to the Chaos Realm itself, was torn open by the forces of Korn led by Junius the Brutal. But by the valiant sacrifices of the Sylvaneth, led by Malathir Weavesong, the stream of chaos from the gate has stifled. However, the chaotic energies had already begun corrupting the lands, making long scarring marks along the landscapes, and shaping it into a far more hellish place, pleasing to those that would serve the chaos gods. I just want to say thank you for watching this content. If you do want to support the channel, we are registered on buymeacoffee.com. The link is down below. It is quite thirsty work, so if you'd like to support the stream or even make regular donations, check that out. That'd be massive, massive help. If not, no worries at all. Take care and let the dice tell the story.